Alrighty, hello there. So this is the third time I've tried to record this. So we're gonna, I wanna watch this little video, this anime official trailer clip called uh, Hell's Paradise Jigoku Raku. Uh, so it is a new anime that's gonna be coming up. Uh, so this is gonna be done by Studio Mappa. It is going to premiere sometime in 2022. Looks very good, looks very interesting. I'm very excited for it. But yeah, let's uh, do this video. Oh yeah, uh, before this, uh, want to check this guy out. He has a lot of anime trailers that you can check out that are upcoming or already starting, you know. But yeah, let's uh, start this. Let's not blow up my ears. You are very dead, my dude. Ah, uh, some, some butterflies, some flowers. So this is like some sort of tapestry of what I'm assuming of Hell's Paradise or whatever this place is called. Or it's probably, that's probably the name of this right here. So, first thing first, she is not in the cage, he is. <laughs> uh, so I'm assuming she's his warden of some sorts uh, to keep him in line. So he doesn't run away or do something. Uh, he is... So there's this woman here. Uh, I'm assuming they're around the same age or something. Or maybe she's a bit older than him. Uh, she is... There's a few shots of her. Uh, I'm assuming she is very important to him. And so sort of matter whether it is his sister, his best friend... His very young mother. <laughs> uh, since there's really no nothing to go off of. Since there's no lines that are said between characters. There is just. You know she's just very important to the to him. So he could have done something. Or something could have happened. Where he is taking the blame. And he is going to protect her. Uh, I could see that happening. Uh, oh yeah so right here. We have something very important. So this is the Tokugawa family. A very f famous and infamous family, very important family, uh, and samurai clans, and that looks like the Oda. Okay, let's see here. What do we have here? So we have the Oda. Yeah, so he looks like from the Oda clan. He is from. Possibly no, it doesn't look like that. No, actually, wait, it kind of does. So he is from probably the Ashika. Ashikaga family, then. Hmm, let's see him. Uh, uh, he's from, probably from that family. So he has some, some pretty important uh, samurai family, samurai clans. Uh, so. We do not see who this is, but I'm assuming it's just a girl. He is, as I, so this is, I think, a, a very important, I don't know, detail to me of what I'm assuming. So I'm assuming he could be a thief. He could be a ninja from a ninja clan. He did something. Now he's being punished. Or he is someone of really no significance and he has really no power as his Seems to be a little bit. His clothes aren't as pristine as the others, but it could just be a little lag from that scene. Now this thing right here, oh my god, my man, you! I would be pissing my pants if I saw this thing. It's got like this, uh, like monk's uh staff through its neck. Its tongue is. Hitting the ground that is tall as a tree. It's got another monk. Oh, it's got another monk staff through its arm and through its legs. And its eye sockets are extended. So it could. And it looks like it has no eyes. But it has nice teeth. Very nice pearly teeth. My man. <laughs> That's just not something you can just gloss over. Oh, gosh. Let's see. 
Yeah, then there's another one with white ro the white and red robes that he does not have. So I'm assuming all these people that are not wearing this. And yeah, then this is, I mean, like, like I'm thinking. Cut, cut right here, back to this person. She's important to him for some, for some reason. Uh, they do not say, obviously. This is just, obviously, speculation. She could just... Yeah, I'm just assuming. Yeah, well, sort of, like, says it in the video, like, in the, the clip. Like, she's important to him that he flashes back to her several times. He's got a giant club. He's got a sword. He does some sort of fire damage. So there's... Obviously, this is supernatural. And, oh my god, that thing is terrifying. <laughs> And my man just jumps up and says, I'm going to um, rip out your tongue or something and blow you with fire uh, with with, with uh, flames out of my fingertips. And there's another man with glasses. Oh, there's a man with glasses. And he also has the white and red robes. So they're obviously very important. Uh, these two, I can... I don't know. I'm assuming this is a girl because of the pink hair, but they could both be men or both be girls. Are they, uh... It's really hard to tell. I would say this is a man and that's a girl, but it could be either or. That would terrify me. This would haunt my nightmares till the end of days. So I'm assuming there's a few things I'm assuming. This is my hypothesis. So he is being punished for something. That is why he is probably covering for her or protecting her for some odd reason. Or he did something and now he has to fix his mistake. And she might be that he fesses up. That's another thing. But this could be the ultimate punishment. That they send people to this godforsaken island with hell itself infested in there. And you have to do something to clear your name or you're just there to die. Oh yeah. Then there's this guy. He has no eyes, so that means, or he keeps his eyes closed. So when a character keeps his eyes closed in an anime, it means they are extremely powerful, or they have some sort of cool power. And when they do not have eyes, they could be even more dangerous. Or they have a special item, like the shard gun. Or uh, like again, we get uh, this cut back to her. So she is obviously someone very important to him. Whether she is alive, I'm assuming in some ways how they show her just sitting there, that she not, not she might not be alive. And he just finds out when he's going back and when he's here. So I could see that maybe. But it would seem like because like this drive this he has, I would maybe assume that she's probably still alive, but who knows? This is gonna be a really cool anime. I hope it's really good and not mid, but if it's still mid, I probably will still enjoy it because I still enjoy Naruto and Naruto is pretty mid. Okay, doing that. Oh, no, no, I'm not reading. I, I, I read some of it. I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, yeah, so. So I was right. He's a ninja. I don't know if he is the ninja. Well, okay. Well, all we know is there's a ninja involved. And now I'm going to watch it because there's a ninja. But yeah, this is my rare anime content. 
that I'm going to post. All I can know is it's going to be very good. And I can sort of see the Doro vibes from this a little bit of how it looks. Because... Doro... Oh, geez, that would be terrifying. Yeah, so this is like Doro. They have similar, yeah, they have a similar look and somewhat of it. You can see it somewhat. Yeah, they have a certain, some of a similar look to it a little bit. But yeah. I'm very interested to see how this turns out. And I would... I can't read that. I don't want to read that. It's just going to spoil me. I don't want to be spoiled. Uh, yep, so this is going to be taking place in the Edo period, which is very infamous in a lot of anime that go to like the feudal Japan is they go to the Edo period. Uh, not 100% sure why, uh, they just do. But I believe the Edo period was very ruthless for a lot of reasons. I think there was, I forget what exactly happens in the Edo period. But yeah, so I would say this is going to be really good. Uh, I can't wait for this to come out. But yeah, check this guy's channel out. He has a lot of anime trailer videos that you can watch be like oh this seems like really cool when i watch the trailer to see it's like hmm, i'll maybe check this out i'll maybe check this out and this is one of these animes that i'm staying in tune for and yeah and like i said this is my rare anime content i know i didn't talk a lot about this uh there's somewhat a little to go on here and now i know he he's the ninja Come on, man, like, if this isn't ninja-like look, I don't know what is. But yeah, uh, furthermore, this is this will be it for the video. Uh, yes, I am back. Uh, I have another video that I'll be uploading of why I was gone again. But yeah.